Welcome to the NBA on 2K Sports. On this very special day, let me be the first to wish everyone out there a happy Veterans Day. Alongside Richard Jefferson and Grant Hill, I'm Brian Anderson. We'll be joined by Ali LaForce courtside. We've got the Detroit Pistons facing the New York Knicks. And so off the tip, it is New York. Richardson with it. Now let's check out the starters for the Detroit Pistons. Pass to Ewing. Just five on the clock. And the lamp is good off the glass. And that gets us rolling. What a tremendous atmosphere in here tonight. And sometimes getting that first bucket puts momentum in your corner. But we'll just have to see. And although he's undersized at his position, his vertical, yeah, that'll clean up a few mistakes. Outside Richardson. Pass to Garnett. To the inside. Here's Ewing. Outside Richardson. Here's the busher. Wing shot on the way. And he gets it to go, hitting off the back of the rim. That's a guy you want taking shots. A quality offensive player. Here's Stackhouse. To the left wing. Here's Thomas. No good there. And New York the other way now. Just over a minute and a half played here in this one. The B.A. The one-hand dunk just looks so fluid. Yeah, absolutely. Even smooth when he's powering at home like that. Here's Thomas. And he tries it off the glass, but it's no good. And the defense was all over him once he got in close. Didn't want him to get too comfortable. And not going to go. He misses his first attempt of the night. They've been having major problems offensively. Definitely in a bit of a dry spell. That was a good look for him from mid-range, but just couldn't make the defense pay. Going inside. And Ewing gets it to go. Out to a hot start. Four makes and five shots to begin this ball game. Pass to Stackhouse. Here's Thomas. Gets it to go from 18 feet away. Nice ball movement there. That's how you break down the defense. First quarter of basketball. Just over two and a half minutes played so far. And here's Richardson. Here's Garnett. 17 foot shot on the way. Good. He hits the jumper. <laughs> An outstanding first quarter from the field. The Pistons trailing. Pass to Dumars. Here's Lanier. There's the block. They get it back. I like that. I mean, some physical play inside. He's not about to give up any easy basket. Dennis Rodman at the line. Two shots. And he knocks down the first one. So he picks up just one from the line that time. And here's New York now. And guys, those road games are never easy. But they had a solid strategy going in and stuck to what they do best. Yeah, despite the challenges of being away from home, they were able to execute cleanly and look really fresh out there. Now here's Richardson. Well, he hasn't put up any points yet in this one. Just owning the painted area. If it's working, no need to change. Defensive foul, charge two. I say it. All right, guys, what do you think about the offensive approach we've seen so far for the Knicks? Team foul. Mike. Detroit calls timeout. Yeah, hoping to tap into something that'll get them clicking. Yeah, they need to regroup and maybe try and draw something up that can get them a clean look at the basket.
And here in the first quarter, a little over three and a half minutes played. Pass to Stackhouse. Here's Dumars. The rebound by DeBusher. And you've got to give credit to the D for never giving up on the play and doing just enough to bother him at the rim. To the paint. Here's Ewing. Oh, and makes it with the kiss. Give him eight points now. And what's working here, each guy is willing to make the next pass. Here's Stackhouse. Looking for his first basket still in this one. Has to Dumars. Let's it go. Doesn't go for him. New York goes the other way with it. From 10 feet away. And it's New York scoring again. He hasn't been quick enough to react to the ball inside. That's helped cause this run. Here's Thomas. Laid it in with a nice touch off the window. Thomas has got his second basket of the night. I just love when teams make it work down low. And that was the mobile one drive. Low resistance to the finish line. Yeah, they're trying to close this gap. Always a good option to probe the paint and see if you can get an easy one inside. Now Richardson. And the Knicks getting another bucket right there. You can't help but look toward their defense. <laughs> they're totally lost. Pass to Dumars. Here's Thomas. Tries it from 19. Connects. The jumper drops. Pick works well there, but the defense left a lot to be desired. Yeah, that just comes down to a lack of effort. The defender has to do a better job fighting through the screen. Now here's Richardson. He's got five. Lanier with the rebound. Here's Thomas. Here's Stackhouse. Well, he hasn't scored yet, but I'm sure that'll change. And he lobs it up top. Up high and down it goes on the lob. I would imagine it's nearly impossible to not get fired up after that play. Grant, check these guys out on the bench. Their reaction says it all. They are fired up. Richardson, that's good. They've shown so much energy right from the start, particularly on the offensive end. They came out swinging, really setting the tone on offense, and the opposition has not been able to respond. Detroit calls timeout. For teachers. Here they are, fans. Put your hands together for your Nick City Dancer. To Lanier. Here's Thomas. Over Richardson. Thomas misses. See, what a rough quarter for him. Nothing seemingly going his way. Here's the busher. Count it. Good. Game. Building a big advantage early with a terrific all-around performance. They got off to such a hot start, and that can keep you energized throughout the whole game. Here's Dumars. Pass to Stackhouse. Here's Dumars. Five on the clock. Here's Lanier. And the ball out of play. The Knicks will have it. And you've got to be in awe of incredible defensive efforts like this. Oh, showing no signs of giving up this lead. That block sent shockwaves into the opposition sails. And the Pistons going with a whole new group out there. Now here's Richardson. He has seven. Pass to DeBusher. Here's Ewing. It's rebounded by Lambeer. 
a perfect example of how to protect the rim. This is why he's out there in situations like this. He stands tall to prevent points. Outside Richardson, down low. Five to shoot. Soft touch off the glass. Richardson's got nine. He still has it missed. Four for four to start the game. They need something good to happen here. Yeah, they've gone way too long without a score. Pass to Hamilton. Guarded by Richardson. Steps back and fires. Can't get it to go. Missed his first one. He was so well positioned to interfere with the shot. Textbook defense take a good angle to the shooter and bother the release. Here's Ewing. Cranked it in off the glass. Ten points for him. They're winning the battle down low by imposing their will. Man, they're just getting run over right now. And you can really see they're starting to show some frustration. Here's Lambeer. Still getting warmed up offensively. No buckets yet in the game from him. And they've come out with a fearless approach on the boards. Releases. And he can't get that one. And Detroit will go the other way with it. Here's Aguirre. It's hauled in by Garnett. Richardson with it. Stolen away. Here's Hamilton. And it's Ewing with a rebound. Inside. Here's Garnett. Pass to DeBusher. On the wing, Richardson takes a three. Rebound Detroit. Guarded by Richardson. From 13, pulled the shot a little left. The bounce goes his way, though. And you can expect him to make it when the D is trash like that. Left side, Richardson. Here's the busher. Two minutes remaining in the first. Two minutes. A minute 58 left in the first quarter of the game. The basket drops, and he gets fouled on the shot. One free throw he coming his way. They have no answer here. defensively inside. The Knicks personal. making a switch here. Second team foul. Patrick Ewing at the line. Oh, one shot. And the Pistons with possession here. Trailing by 17. Pass to Aguirre. Here's Hamilton. Six to shoot. Here's Lambeer. Uses the glass on the layup. A quality pass setting up a quality shot. It's just textbook basketball. Outside Brunson. alive pass to Garnett here's Ewing outside Brunson he hits it just before the shot clock expires and the Knicks lead by 17 here's Hamilton 50 seconds left to play in the first Pass to Wallace. Here's Aguirre. Good setup. Marcus Led him to the rack perfectly for the layup. And you like the balance here. Not just falling in love with the three ball. Here's King. Now quiet so far offensively. Searching for his first points of the game. Baseline jumper. It doesn't go for him. And Detroit will go the other way with it. The way they've gotten after rebounds has been impressive. Here's Aguirre. 
Here's Hamilton. Pass to Lambier. Here's Wallace. Missed it, even after all of those chances. And so it's New York, liking their chances. Ending the quarter with a 15-point lead. Defense is setting the tone. And more NBA action on 2K Sports. Coming your way right after this. If you're just tuning in, we've got a wide margin on the scoreboard, but plenty of time left for a comeback. And a comfortable margin for the Knicks here, guys. It's simple. The main takeaway from the first quarter is they're winning this game with defense. Making it as difficult as possible for the offense to find clean looks, great stuff. Setting the floor for Detroit. Here's Dumars. Pass to Rodman. To the middle. Thomas, that's good. Thomas has got his third bucket of the night. Credit their discipline. They've been working for high percentage shots. Here's Reed to the left side wing. Here's Marbury. And that's good. His first bucket of the game. And the defense has no one to blame but themselves. So they just let him get right to the rim. That's a great possession. Put your best players in a position to succeed. Going all in, that was the 2K drive. Well worth a second look. And the way he's been able to protect the ball from the defense is really incredible. He makes it look so easy. Detroit with the ball. After the basket by New York. Just five to shoot. Tries it from 19. Here's Lanier. And he dunks it down. Oh, nothing soft about that. Was not going to be denied. Just took the dunk that was right in front of him. And that's his MOB physical. Get in position for the putback and throw it down. The defense got to know that's what he's looking to do. To the paint. Oh, a nice one-handed slam right there. And that's what happens when you don't take care of the ball. Hey, that makes the turnover hurt even more. We know mistakes lead to breaks. That's just textbook right there. Drains the triple. He's got five. And just not letting up at all. I mean, you have to love this approach. You want to get the ball to the guys who make plays. This is when good players really get after it. He can sense that they're really, and he's going to put his foot on the pedal. Man, the defender really went after him. Bob Lanier at the line. Two shots. First free throw is good. That's also good. So he hits both free throws. It's always nice to see a big fella be able to knock down some free throws and make teams pay from the line. Outside Richardson. To the inside, Garnett. And the layup falls. He's been playing great unselfish basketball. Really putting the rock in the hands of the right shooters. His court vision has been on display in this one. He's doing a tremendous job just orchestrating the offense beautifully. And they're plus five on the boards after that rebound. Intercepted! Here's Stackhouse. That shot is off. Good D by Richardson. And now the Knicks on the break. He's got it. Three for seven now. Taking it right at the rack. I mean, that defense is looking real frustrated. That's the kind of aggression you want to see when you've got a team on the ropes. Here's Lanier. Six points for him. Here's Dumars. And that one is hammered home. And one move ahead of the defense. A solid pick. And then the monster dunk to complete the play. Well done. Well, great chemistry on display. He understood where to put the screen in order to free up his teammate. 
ahead in the second quarter. A little under three and a half minutes played already. That went a little long. Outside Richardson from the arc. And again, New York with the triple. When he gets a quality look like this at the perimeter, he can almost be automatic. Knicks lead, 44, 27. Pass to Lanier. Here's Dumars. Here's Thomas. That one doesn't drop. The Knicks go the other way with it. In transition, here they come. Great teamwork on that drive. Punctuated by a strong finish. Yeah, that's nice execution. Running with purpose and creating an easy scoring opportunity off the break. Pass to Thomas. Here's Dumars. Here's Thomas. Looking to get it going. And it's good on the lay-in. Thomas has got four points this quarter. It's fun for us to sit back and watch him go to work. But that's our job, not the defenses. They left him too open on that play. Here's Ewing. 13 points in the game. And yes, it's good. He's seven for eight now. Looks like we're starting to see a pattern here. Not afraid to get in the paint and get wet. Pass to Dumars. Here's Thomas, guarded by Richardson. Shoots from the right block. It's rebounded by New York. You have to credit their effort. I mean, they've done an amazing job on the glass. Goes back up. And he sinks the layup. Barnett. Give him eight points now. Just so successful getting the ball inside and finding those great looks. Now a timeout called by Detroit. Protecting the rim has to be their top objective right now. I'm sure Coach is going to give them an earful about that. He can't be happy with that soft interior D. Any hope of coming back to win this game looks near impossible. I know. The way things have gone so far, hard to imagine. Here's Thomas. Give him eight. And he's going for the oop here. Out to the wing. And another fast break opportunity for the Knicks. Here we go. Ball stolen. Here we go. All alone. Throw it down on the breakaway jam. Excellent outlet pass. Helping to make transition opportunities like this easier. Pass to Ewing. It's tipped. Here's Thomas. Shot from the top of the key. That's bucket number five. He's five for 12 now. Thomas has got five baskets and 12 tries so far. Now here's Richardson. Defense right on him. Here's the busher. He shoots it. Arms link from the hoop. He knocks it down. And the Knicks lead by 19. He has been a key factor for them offensively, scoring with consistency. To the wing, right side. Pass to Thomas. Grant, you look at the playoffs last year. I mean, a lot of big name stars struggled to deliver. Is that every year, or you think that was an anomaly? I, you know, B.A., I think it was a bit of an anomaly. I mean, I, I, think, I think what's happened in the league in the last few years with the bubble and then the restart last season, there's been a lot of basketball played, and I think it's impacted a lot of players. So I think moving forward, we'll get back to a level of normalcy with the rest and recovery of the offseason, and big-name stars will continue to excel and thrive in the years to come. And right now, they're plus eight in the rebounding category. That's helping them run away with this. Here's the three. 
to get the rebound. Pass to DeBusher. Here's Garnett. Gets a very good look and converts. Ten points for him. In force feeding the ball inside. I mean, no reason to go away from what's working. Here's Thomas. He's got 12 to the right side. Tipped away. Nails it from three. You give a shooter of his caliber that much time to seam it up? Oh, yeah, you're done. This Piston squad struggling. Next lead. Pass to Dumars. Here's Thomas. Inside. Hamilton. And down it goes. Dumped it through off a beautiful setup. And that's how you lead a team. Literally. On the wing, Richardson. He's got 12. Over to the left wing. Shot clock at six. Pass to DeBusher. To the wing on the left. Off the left rim and out. And here's Detroit. Here's Hamilton. Here's Thomas. There's the three. The rebound by DeBusher. If they want to come back, he needs to be better. They get it back. And there's the slam! Dunk to finish it off. <laughs> Crashes the glass with a 40, then puts it back strong. Next level, man. This guy's just going out and making a play. Here's Thomas. He's got 12. Here's Dumars. That three's off the mark. If this quarter is any indication, he's not going to be the guy to turn this game around in their favor. Ewing, no good. Offensively, it's been a struggle for him. Yeah, they need to string together some shots to have any kind of chance. Joe Dumars. And that one's good, Dumars. He picks the exact right moment to get himself a clear line to the basket. Here's Richardson after the Pistons picking up a basket just moments ago. Pass to DeBusher. Two minutes. Back to Richardson. Two minutes. 18 feet out. That one off the back iron and out. And so it's Detroit with it. Here's Dumars. Again, the Piston score. Nice move to get inside and create a good look for himself. Here's Garnett. Pass to Ewing. Here's Garnett. Out left to the wing. Here's Ewing. 19 points in the game. Outside Richardson. To the left side wing. Here's Ewing. And the call is going to be, yes, on an illegal screen. You're not going to fool the officials too often on an illegal screen. That's a very avoidable turnover. you got to focus on the details. Both teams will make substitutions. Here's Aguirre. And, yeah, he, he still was moving at the point of contact. Thirteen. Here's Aguirre. Pass to Wallace. Here's Thomas. Lays it up and banks it in. Thomas. Thomas has got 14 points. And even though they're down, it's not on him. He's been lights out on offense for them this quarter especially. Here's King. What? No scoring yet from him, but that's likely to change. Six on the shot clock. Goes up on the baseline. The putback controls the rebound and the putback. They've shown the power inside. Their rebounding effort has been sensational. And we've got 28 seconds left to play in the first half. Pass to Lambeer. Here's Thomas. Here's Aguirre. 
It's blocked. Here's King. It's good if it goes. Ooh, he released it in time, but it's off the mark. And so a pretty lopsided game through the first half. Knicks out in front. They lead by 18. Don't go anywhere, folks. We'll be back in a moment. It's the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Hey again, everybody. I'm Ernie Johnson. Shaq is here. Kenny's here. You're watching the NBA Halftime Show on 2K Sports. New York holding the upper hand after the first two quarters. They are in control of this game, up by 18. Kenny, give us your tip. The work they put in on the glass has been the difference maker. Truly an all-hands-on-deck attack. Give them credit for being the more aggressive team. Rebounding is one of the stats that sometimes gets overlooked. Not tonight. And Shaq, how about what you saw from the Pistons? They're getting abused in the paint defensively. Letting their opponents set the tone. Can't match up physically. You're toast. That's what the scoreboard is reflecting right now. Toast with butter. And that'll do it for us. The third quarter about to begin with Kevin Harlan standing by. We'll catch you on the flip side. My brother. Fans and, and with a big gap on the scoreboard, the second half begins with very different goals for these teams. One side trying to mount a comeback, one side trying to protect their lead. Here's Thomas. The teardrop, and it's good on the layup. 16 points for him. Showing off with the floater game. Not a shot you can swat. And we just had to see that mobile one drive one more time. Great stuff. Yeah, he has that fight in him. Love the aggression at the rim when they are trying to claw back into the game. And for the Pistons. That one goes in. <laughs> a great move. I mean, the defense has no response. Yeah, taking it right to the rim. Or he imagines that might be discussed at halftime. That's going to be on the film. Here's Stockhouse. It's deflected. And it's going to be out of bounds. Detroit will have another go. And now it's time to take another view of that huge swat. Yeah, just some terrific effort there. And you know the whole team will get an energy boost off a block like that one. And Detroit has possession. They trail by 18. Down to five on the shot clock. Releases. Dumars misses. And here are the Knicks. Down low. Here's Garnett. Oh, a big finish with a one-handed jam. Love to see him inside passing like this, as well as guys being on the same page. Pass to Stackhouse. Here's Dumars. Here's Rodman. Over to the left wing. Here's Thomas. The shot comes out. Good D by Richardson. This isn't how they wanted to start the second half. Only one of four. To the middle. Here's Garnett. And he floats it in for the easy two. Credit the sweet setup on that one. <laughs> They're just taking what the defense gives them. And right now, that's the interior. 18 feet out. Thomas, that's good. Thomas. Thomas has got four points in the quarter. And he's coming off a huge performance, and his confidence couldn't be any higher. And his coach knows that, too. When it ain't broke, leave it alone. Until someone stops him, just let him roll. When you've made your first three shots of the half, I think it's okay for a heat check. Here's Stackhouse. Oh, and he nails it from the high post. He has six. Just outstanding distribution. This is the kind of team chemistry that you love to see. Outside Richardson. Pass to Ewing. And he'll draw the foul. He'll head to the line for two. Man, he made sure to get his money's worth on that foul. First team foul. Patrick Ewing. At the line, two shots.
first one falls. So he gets them both. Here's Thomas. 18 points for him. That'll Detroit calls timeout. Touch over two and a half minutes of basketball played here in the third quarter. Pass to Stackhouse. Here's Dumars. Here's Lanier. Clock at six. The ball's knocked loose. Oh, stolen by Richardson. Fast break, New York. It falls. Five for 11 in the game. Okay, so they've looked energized and focused starting this half. Coming out of the break, making four out of their first five. Pass to Stackhouse. Here's Dumars. Here's Rodman. He takes it in. And there's a whistle. He'll head to the line to shoot two. Second personal foul. First team foul. Dennis Rothman at the line. Two shots. First one falls for him. And good on the second, so he makes them both. Third quarter of basketball here. A little under three and a half minutes gone by. Outside Richardson. Pass to DeBusher. Back to Richardson. Shot clock at five. Here's Ewing. He drains it as the shot clock ticks down. He's got 25. He's pouring it on at a nice clip, and the rest of the team is stumping up as well. Here's Dumars. Again, the miss by the Pistons. This is the definition of forcing it. He's trying to get himself going, but taking tough shots just won't do it. Ewing and the Knicks getting another bucket right there. And guys, Knicks the way this defense is getting manhandled down low, you have to wonder if they're at 100% right now. Here's Rodman. Five points in the game. Pass to Thomas. And they'll keep possession. Goes up again. It's hauled in by Garnett. Here's New York. They're on a 14-6 run. Detroit with a rebound. Here's Dumars. Give him eight. Puts it up from 15. Count the basket. Joe Dumars. He's got 10. And despite the defender's length, he goes right up from the mid-range. Hey, when you trust your shot like he does, it doesn't matter how much size you're giving up. He feels the mid-range in his territory. Now here's Richardson. He's got 14. Garnett no good. Trying to find a spark here. Yes, indeed. A rough stretch offensively. They could really use a basket. And here's New York now. Dumars grabs the miss. He's been off. Still, they're up, so not all is lost. Fires from the wing, and he's going to the line for two. The official saw contact while he was going up. Well, that was clearly a foul. All right, guys, what do you think about the offensive approach we've seen so far for the Knicks? The Pistons making a switch here. Boy, you love how guys are making plays for one another here. Yeah, just a balanced attack, a total team effort. Here's Garnett. Picked it out of midair. Out to the right wing. Here's Stackhouse. 
He has six. Pass to Lanier. Four on the clock. The Pistons need to get one up quick. Thomas. Offline with a three. Boy, this could snowball if they continue to put up points. I can't say enough about their performance. The assist numbers certainly stand out. <laughs> they really emphasize ball movement here today. Here's Thomas. He's got 19. It's not going to go for him. Good D by Richardson. Pass to Garnett. Uses the glass to finish the layup. 16 points for him. Very little resistance around the rim right now. That's the fifth straight bucket they've given up in the paint. Here's Stackhouse. Here's Hamilton. Puts it up from 12. Tries again. And Lanier gets it to go. Making the most of that possession. Unwilling to give up on the play. Outside Richardson. Charity stripe shot. Lanier with the rebound. Here's Stackhouse. He's got six. And he gets the bucket. And he's doing everything he can offensively to lift them out of this hole. But I'm not sure his hot shooting can do it alone. Outside Richardson. Pass to Ewing. And down it goes. Jam that one home. And he just punches home the one-hand finish. Hey, two points the easy way. Here's Hamilton. Here's Stackhouse. Give him eight points now. To the paint. Hamilton with the bucket. Assisted by Jerry Stackhouse. And the Knicks with the possession here. To the inside. Ewing. Oh, it's blocked. It deflects off the backboard. Here's Hamilton. Unable to get that one. Showing great intensity around the rim. It's part of why he's a respected defender. Yeah, you can see why he's established that reputation. Strong understanding of how to defend at the rim. Okay, so if I were to say this was a disaster of a period for him, it would be an understatement. But hey, sometimes you've got to shoot your way out of the slump, even for him. And here's Richardson. 16 points for him. to Garnett. Off the mark there with a three. Oh, man, he can't get anything to fall. You can feel his frustration. Yeah, <laughs> right now, he's just in his own head. Not much you can do to try and push through. The officials were right on top of that one. Richard Hamilton at the line. Two shots. And he makes the first. Second free throw, no good. Pass to Houston. The three. No good that time. And Detroit will go the other way with it. Here's Hamilton. He's got five. Here's Lanier. And he drops in the layup off the glass. Ten points for him. Nice ball movement there. Delivered the pass right on time. Tries to break his ice. And a foul this called on the way up. So he'll take two from the free throw line. First personal foul. Second team foul. Richie Garrett at the line. Two shots. And he drops the first. And he makes both free throws. And the Pistons with possession here. They trail by 18.
Pass to Aguirre. Shot clock at six. Here's Rodman. Tipped. Here's Reed. Boy, he's been patient so far. Nothing yet on the scoreboard. Pure from three-point range. This is why you always have to chase guys off the arc because everyone has a three-point shot now. Next lead, 86. Pass to Stackhouse. And so he draws the foul, headed to the line to shoot a pair. First personal foul. Fourth team foul. Jerry Stackhouse. And he can't get the first one. Here in the second half, they've really gone cold from the line, and it's hurting their chances. And he sinks the second. We've got 108 left to play in the third quarter here. Pass to Ewing. Here's the busher. Inside. Puts it up from 12. Oh, plenty of contact on that shot. Officials call the foul, and he'll take two free throws now. No foul. 13 foul. Patrick Ewing at the line. Two shots. The first free throw is good. And that one goes in. Two from the line that time. Yeah, they've really made a concerted effort to get to the line here in the second half. Pass to Stackhouse. Here's Lanier. There's 39 seconds left in the third quarter. And again, the Pistons missing. They're enjoying a sizable lead. And what I like, B.A., they haven't stopped pressing the issue. Good work there as it goes. Rate of baskets assisted, it's a stat I really like. It tells the story of how well you are playing team offense. And Detroit has possession. After the basket by New York. Here's Aguirre. Let's it go from deep. And it's Ewing with a rebound. Carries it down low. 33 points for him. They've been very well-rounded and extremely focused. Yeah, not just an impressive showing on offense, but on defense as well, executing their game plan perfectly. And so it's the New York Knicks already up 26 points as this quarter ends. Their efficiency has been off the charts. They're running their sets well with patience and purpose. Back after this. And while we have a chance, let's go to our State Farm assist of the game. This is the definition of team chemistry. I love to see this kind of communication and connection between teammates leading to the perfect pass. Serving it up on a platter, that is a beautiful dish. And two teammates on the same page? Ooh. And we reach the fourth quarter in a game that may already be out of hand. Now here's Richardson, covered by Sadoransky. Pass to DeBusher. And again, New York with the triple. Cool. That man is laser focused. That, that's bad defense for a team that has a long way to go to catch up. Effort like this makes you wonder if they've already packed it in for the game, ready to go on to the next. Gotta at least show a little heart out here. And for Detroit, now here's Sadoransky to the left wing. Five on the clock. Here's Johnson. The Knicks pull it in. And for the Knicks. It's stolen by Johnson. To the middle. A nice shot by Lambeer. And he has to build on this because we can see where him being a ghost out there has gotten them so far. We played just over a minute here in the fourth. Pass to Ewing. Here's Garnett. Five to shoot. Here's the busher. 
Rebounded by Johnson. Sadaransky with it. Knocks it loose. And Richardson comes to help. Maybe we've heard a lot of coaches say, including Warriors coach Steve Kerr, about load management. If you want to see the Stars play more often, cut the schedule back. Maybe 72 games. Grant, your thoughts? You know, B.A., this is a problem and a concern, I think, for the league. You go back 20, 30 years ago, the Stars played every night when available. Now you're not seeing that with the workload and the back-to-back -back and the concern with players and their safety and the amounts of money they make over their contracts. 72 games is a possibility, but I prefer to keep it at 82. Maybe I'm just a traditionalist. Here's Ewing following the score by Detroit. And the Knicks miss again. Now I understand that that shot didn't go down, but they will take that look every trip down the floor. Wallace misses. And here's New York now. Outside Richardson. Pass to Ewing. Here's Garnett. Covered by Johnson. Elbow shot. And that's good for two. Garnett. Just continuing to pile it on, refusing to let up. If he has space in the mid-range, he'll let it fly. Doesn't matter if the score is tied or they are up big. Now here's Sadaransky. Here's Garnett. Pass to DeBusher. Here's Ewing. like somebody came out this half on a mission and his intensity on offense has been fun to watch. Who poked away. Oh, stolen by Richardson. Sadaransky with the steal. In transition. Finished off the break. His energy is unmatched. And all of a sudden, that man was just on the other end. Wow. Here's Richardson. Oh, that's his eighth make of the game. He's only missed four so far. And staring at a sizable deficit, the defense has to tighten up. Pass to Aguirre. Now Sadaransky. Here's Aguirre. And the NBA last season introducing a 100 camera system that allows for a video game-like presentation with virtual angles. It's pretty cool. Video games used to chase the league. Now the league's kind of chasing the video games. Yeah, well, this is where the future is heading. It is so cool to see all the different angles that you can now see a basketball game from. That's what makes it fun. That's what makes it exciting. And the NBA, they're doing the right thing. And I know scouting departments are using them as evaluation tools as well. Oh, they're always going to figure out a way to scout more and to evaluate more because it helps them when they're negotiating players' contracts. Here's Aguirre. Blocked! And it's going to be out of bounds. Detroit will have another go. The Knicks making a switch here. Reed's checked in. And the Pistons making a change here. Here's Johnson. Down to five on the shot clock. Out to the wing. Here's Aguirre. And he makes no mistake. Slam dunk. Come on, B.A. He sure can rise. Grant, that's as good as it gets. One of the best in the league. Richardson against Johnson. Now here's Richardson. He's guarded closely. Garnett, that's good. Garnett. That's 10 straight points they've Mixley. given up in the painted area. 105. <laughs> And here's Detroit. Pass to Johnson. Here's Lambeer. Well, the NBA has gotten tougher on flagrant fouls. But you see instances where Richard guys get hurt. They miss a lot of time. And yet, there's only a one-game penalty for the fouler. Something to look at, you think, RJ, or no? 
Well, if the flagrant results in games missed due to injury, then maybe the Fowlers should miss more games. The only problem with that is you can see players starting to embellish on their injury in order to make sure that other people get suspended. That's how petty our league is. Offensive rebound. Well, it was only a matter of time before they finally get the bucket. I love this game plan. That's 10 points in a row from in close. 76. Pass to Hamilton. Here's Lambeer. Here's Aguirre. Here's Johnson. Oh, he used the shot fake to create the angle, but he couldn't get it to fall. Richardson against Johnson. Richardson, no good. Here's Aguirre. Pass to Johnson. Here's Aguirre. Here's Hamilton. The Knicks pull it in. Here's Garnett, covered by Johnson. Here's Garnett. Pass to Reed. 19-footer. And it's New York scoring again. He's been perfect this quarter. They keep feeding him, and he keeps delivering. Boy, they'd love if anyone could get a bucket. Yeah, their offense has been grinding to a halt. Here's Aguirre. Back to Johnson. And he banks in the layup. Johnson's got four points this quarter. Rate of baskets assisted, it's a stat I really like. It tells the story of how well you are playing team offense. To the inside. Pass to Reed. Here's to Busher. Down low. Outside Richardson. Here's Garnett. That shot off the mark. And Detroit will go the other way with it. Here's Hamilton from 20 feet. They grab their own miss. Lambier, no good. Here's the busher. Hey, now five for eight. Shooting a pretty good percentage right now. And he's been much more assertive here in the second half. Leading to his spots, executing the ease. 78. Pass to Aguirre. Here's Hamilton. Outside Johnson. Oh man, he's feeling it this quarter. They should be looking to get him going every trip down the floor. One side is dominated tonight. Yeah, they've done a fantastic job of imposing their pace and style of play. Johnson against Richardson. Shoots over Johnson. The Pistons clear it. Here's Aguirre. Into the lane. Oh, there's a killer two-hand slam. That one rocked this arena. That's the kind of dunk right there that makes you think he's going to rip down the rim. Looking to get back on track. The shot, no good. And Detroit will go the other way with it. Pass to Hamilton. Aguirre can't hit. Here's Garnett. Banked it in off the glass. Got it in close. And unless it's an open three, that's the key to efficient offense. Here's Hamilton. Two minutes. Here's Lambeer. One forty-nine left to play in the fourth. Pulls it from the top of the key. Can't cash it in from close range. Defense pulled out all the stops to shut him down there. 
Oh, and makes it with the kiss. Good decision making. Scopes the situation, puts the pass right on the mark. And last season, new trophies unveiled for the conference finals. Honoring Larry Bird, Magic Johnson, Bob Cousy, Oscar Robertson. I love bringing up these names again. I agree, B.A. I mean, these are legends. These were those that laid the foundation for this league to be successful. So the idea of adding a little hardware and putting their names on it, I couldn't think of anything better. Offensive rebound. A minute 15 left in the fourth quarter. And a bit of a battle for the ball. And the officials signal a jump ball here. And so it's Detroit with it. Back to Johnson. Six to shoot. To the paint. A nice shot by Lambeer. Good passing to set that up. Teamwork on display. Pass to King. From deep. The Pistons clear it. And now the Pistons in transition. Here's Johnson. And Reed pulls it down. And the Knicks with possession. Here's King. And a miss there on the triple. Here's Aguirre. Uses the glass on the layup. If the defense lets him inside, he will not hesitate. He'll gladly drop that thing right in the cup. About seven seconds separating the shot and game clocks. Here's Marbury. Six on the shot clock. The offensive rebound. And again, the Knicks missing. Now here's Johnson. And so it's the Knicks taking care of business in this one. Showing that they're the far superior team. They win it going away. I'll tell you what. Give it up for their fans. They love to watch this team dominate. You best believe they're all going home happy tonight. And that's going to do it tonight, folks, for our broadcast. For our terrific 2K Sports crew, this is Brian Anderson saying thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.
big house, but the plans for through. She just wanna take a ride on the south side. On the